Hi everyone! In this video, I will be unboxing the UP board, which is a computer, a very small computer about the size of the Raspberry Pi. So it is a very small computer and it can run Windows 10 too. So here you can see the box. It just arrived today. It came from the Netherlands to here, Puerto Rico. So let's unbox it. Alright, I just opened the box and let's take a look. Here is the quick start guide of my new up board. There you can see it completely. So now, as you can see, I ordered the up board which is inside here and inside here is the power adapter. So. I'm going to take off first, I'm going to unbox the power adapter, here you can see it, the, the power adapter. Here is the power adapter. Um, it is rated 5 volts, 4 amps, so it is a quite good to power the upboard. And here inside you can see the different plugs available for the upboard depending on where you live. Um, the different charger, different plugs, I mean. Um, and the European adapter, here it is. Alright, so now the time has come to unbox the up board. So, Here it is, inside a bag. Let's open it. And here it is, the up board. As you can see, it comes with the heatsink pre-installed. This is the two gigabyte version of RAM, two gigabyte and 32 gigabyte eMMC, which is the storage. So it's really good that it came with this heatsink because the particular processor, um, it doesn't overheat that much, but it tends to overheat. It used an Intel Atom X5C3550, I believe it is that processor. Um, no, I mean 38350 or something like that. Anyway, it used an Intel Atom X5 processor. So you can see it's pretty much um, the same fine, uh, form factor as the Raspberry Pi. You can see here the power plug, the HDMI plug. This is a USB on the go 3.0 port. This is the Ethernet uh, adapter port and four USB 2.0. Um, this one is 3.0 and these are 2.0. So, oh, and these are the header pins. Um, it is like the Raspberry Pi, but um, this is x86 archi architecture. So as I said, since it uses an Intel Atom processor, you can basically install uh, Windows 10 in this thing. It has 32 gigabytes EMC storage, so that's plenty for the Windows 10 installation, and two gigabytes of RAM. So you can pretty much install um, the Windows 10 64-bit edition in it, um, since it has two gigabytes of RAM. So anyway, let's take a look at what came inside this box. I have here the power adapter with the plugs and the up board right here. So, thank you for watching this video. I will be the um, I mean yeah, I will be making videos about installing Windows 10 inside this thing. So, please um, keep looking at, at my channel for other videos about the up board. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like this video, comment on it, um, share it with your friends, and please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.